Yeah, and a 24 second shot clock, so a lot of things yeah. are different. New ball we've been practicing with, uh, so it's fun and exciting. You know, get some experience with the with the new guys and try and uh, you know gel a little bit over there. What do you see out of the new guys so far? Are they quick learning curve? Oh uh, yeah, you know we, you know our offense is kind of complex. We put a lot of stuff in, so they got a lot coming at them. But they're all doing a good job. You know, working hard with a with a good attitude. So you know that's all you can ask for. And and uh, I think we're all excited about the opportunity to go play some other people. Last year, I know you guys had a trip planned to go somewhere and it just didn't work out with the numbers and whatnot. So we'll see excitement level now that a uh, whole new crop and the guys that were kind of with the transition last year. Weekend, they offered. Yeah, everyone's excited because we have so many new guys, you know, uh, four freshmen, you know, a lot of new transfers that are uh, looking like they're going to be able to go on the trip with us now. And uh, so that's that's good for us just to, you know, get some more games under our belt, you know, get ahead of the, you know, rest of the rest of the teams, you know, to, to play together and get used to playing with each other. With this trip and with how deep you guys went in the CBI, the games and all the practices too, I mean, how much can that build upon towards next year, just having so much time kind of being cohesive together? Yeah, definitely. Just, it builds momentum, you know, going into the season, you know, showing up on, on practice uh, in October, we'll, we'll have a base idea of what coach wants and expects and uh, base knowledge of the offense and defense. So, you know, that just, Gets, a, gets us ahead of everyone else, so you know, we'll take it in any way. How important do you see it being a team building thing as, as much as it is for basketball? Definitely. You know, coaches, he's harped on that too. You know, we're going to have some fun over there and you know, get to go sightseeing. And you know, I don't think anyone's been to Europe, except for maybe I think Olu said he's been to Europe, but not Italy. So you know, it'll be a new experience for all of us. And you know, we're all looking forward to the, learning about the culture and just being able to hang out for, for 10 days with each other. How does a guy like Olu help the team this season? Oh, he's aggressive. You know, he uh, attacks, attacks the glass, and you know he's aggressive. He's a senior, so he has a you know sense of urgency to 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 win and and uh, help us compete. And that's that's what he's been doing so far. When do you guys take off? Uh, Monday, I believe, from from Portland. So not looking forward to the the plane flight, but. You know, looking forward to getting there and you know experiencing new culture and playing some basketball. How long is that flight? I don't know. I think we're going to Atlanta and then from Atlanta to Rome. I'm I'm not even sure. Maybe like 13 hours or something. And how long are you going to be there? Um, 10 days. So I think uh, we're going to. They said Rome, Florence, uh, Lake Como, and then we leave out of Milan. So. Which one are we looking forward to the most? I have no idea. I heard Milan is the fashion capital of the world. So maybe buy some clothes there, but I have no idea. Different style of basketball over there, obviously. I'm very excited to kind of you know, learn something new. Yeah, you know, it'd be it'd be fun, you know, to to play a different style of basketball. Like I said, with the 24 second shot clock, that changes a lot of things uh, offensively. You know, got to get uh, quick hitters and and stuff. So it'll be a fun experience for all of us and and uh, learn learn about the, the FIBA game, I guess. It's been a full year now since Coach Altman's come. What, what are your, your feelings of familiarity with his offense and what he wants you guys to do on defense? Um, yeah, he's, he's a guy that, you know, he, he harps on the same things over and over. So, you know, I've been here a year and he's, he's already repeating things. So it's nice that I know, you know, what's going on. I can kind of help some of the new guys and, uh, you know, it's it's nice to be able to to point your teammates in the right direction. So, so it's help. It's help then. Oh yeah, definitely. You know, I think everyone's settled in. You know, last year we didn't really. It was hard to say we had any vets because no one knew the offense. Everything was new. Um, so it's nice to to have people that know what's going on already. What are you using the offseason to work on? What what 